Oh, by the way, guys, I'm doing a Q&A right now on Instagram, so if you guys want to be a part of it, there's a link in the description, follow my Instagram, you can ask me anything. What's going on, guys? Hope you're having a fantastic day. Now, I'm super excited for today's video because I know a lot of you guys are going to love this. Today, we're going to be after the Kevin Owens. I know a lot of you guys have requested this, and I'm super interested to check them out. If you guys are new here, please do subscribe. This community is growing so quickly right now, and I'd love for you to be a part of it. And if you guys have already subscribed, drop a like. Why not? It's free, and it helps you out more than you think. Anyway, guys, let's get into it. Now, this is another one of those WWE guys that you guys said is just great. Oh. Already, get this fact. He's kind of fat. Wait, wait, wait. Is it just me or is he kind of fat? Like not to be mean to the guy because I'm sure he's doing very well for himself on the money front But surely he should be kind of I thought all these guys were like insanely jack. I don't know what his thing is, but Ha, huh, that's kind of weird. Anyway guys, keep watching. Oh He does hit very hard though. Double foot stomp. Like this. Oh AJ Styles, yeah. Double knee arm breaker. Ooh. Ooh. Kevin Owens is the man who Ooh, Finn Balor, of course. Benefited after Balor had to relinquish the title. He became the next uh, That's hurting me. Step, step. step oh! Oh! oh. That, that was a great move! That was a great move. Took wait. Is there, the is there another part? Okay, wait. Let's 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 watch, let's watch that one more time. So I think what happens. I think what happens. So what happens? He he uses the guy's leg, flips him over. Like that first, of course, requires a lot. I mean, is the guy jumping or is he pushing him? It looks like he's pushing him. He lands back and then just kicks him right in the head. That classic leg slap thing. I love that. Oh. Oh. Damn, that guy's huge. Lariat. Oh. He has a full flip. Look at AJ Styles' his face right there. Let's see this. Oh, I think that's one of the interesting things about wrestling. A lot of people say one of the sort of aspects of wrestling, which people often make fun of, is the way the guys are all jacked meatheads. I think in the instance, I think in the instance of Kevin Owens, that's not really the case, and he really does buck the trend. Which is a super interesting thing to see. I think this guy is incredible almost because he's exactly what you wouldn't think a wrestler to be. He's not that big. He's not even that. Strong, he's not that muscly. He's just a really aggressive, violent guy, and I love the way it goes into his character. I mean, it is it is really good from an MMA from an MMA perspective. Jesus Christ, I don't have words right now. Side out, cover again. Really cross face. Like his moves look like it really hurts. It's pretty good. Oh. Oh. As another example where he uses his weight almost as like a character trait or a way of building the match almost. Like, I think in my opinion, that move wouldn't have looked as painful if that other guy next to him did it. Because at the same, t like, I, I understand why people look so jacked to make him look scary. But this guy is looking just terrifying just by the way he moves. And actually, he's pretty agile for a guy of his size. So I... I mean, in my opinion, it almost adds to his character the way he's the way he's been. He's he's a little pudgy. Got a small the back. Here's a can make a oh. high elbow by Kevin Owens. Oh. Wow. You know, got all of it. Top rope on Hilo. Damn, you did a flip and everything. Electric chair, sit out, face buster. Oh. No Those face busters is. look painful. Roman DDT. Owens, oh! DDT. Those look like you almost spike them on their heads. And I really don't like that. That's a move that's actually completely banned in MMA because it's real. I mean, it is. MMA is bad for your head. But that is just awful for your head. And I love the way WWE wrestlers almost make it look real. But at the same time, how is their head not getting crushed every time they do that move? If you guys can explain that to me, uh, I'd be appreciated. Because it looks almost like their head's just going straight down into the mat. So, how are they not dead? Explain that to me. Explain that one to me, guys, if you can. Stood up right up. Cover now. Ruthless Kevin Owens is still in. Seth Rollins, of course. Oh. Yeah, there was nothing supporting him other than his head. I don't understand how that's not terrible for his neck. Straight up. Cover. Ooh, looks, the it looks fast. Oh. Fireman's carry uh -oh. gut buster. Uh oh. Line it up for a super kick. Oh. oh a gut buster. Oh, fight my brother. Oh, that's nice. That's a nice one. Because we've, we've checked out AJ Styles before on the channel. And one of his classic moves is he jumps onto the rope and then jumps on, like, hits him with the forearm. But I love that, where they almost took like a twist on it. He grabbed him out of the air and did it. I think this guy, this guy understands the sport. This guy really does understand the sport of wrestling. And he makes everything he does look terrifying. Oh, and a gut buster by Owens. 
Corner slingshot elbow drop. What is this? And now Owens with an opportunity perhaps to the elbow into the tall to Ziggler. Oh, his weight, his weight makes it look so much scarier. St steam breaker. Huh. Oh. What a neck breaker. What's the difference between a steam breaker and a net breaker? Just quick question. Cannonball sent on. I mean, look out. Oh. His weight makes it look so scary. He's a big guy. Oh. I am always amazed when I see the way across the ring. Oh. Wait, I swear that was the guy he was teaming with earlier. So maybe they broke up. Oh. Maybe they broke up. Oh. Don't kick my boy Seth. Oh. Stunner. Oh. It's like a stone cold stutter almost. I know that move, guys. I know that move. Oh. Oh. Oop. Tyler Tyler power bomb. Oh. To the with a thud. No. I love the way he just yells. No, no, yeah, so this is the guy who was fighting Tyler earlier. Power bomb into the apron. Pop up power bomb. Oh. I think the power bomb is one of those things that looks so painful, but maybe isn't so much because of the way they're throwing them onto the ground. Even though I guess they're landing flat on their back, so it's not that bad. But it looks just like awful. Like just the sound of it, the, the even the visual of just that. Oh boy, guys, that looks like it hurts. The superstar shakeup comes your way next week. Oh, Raw and SmackDown on the pop up power. Dude. Oh, Avalanche sweet fisherman again. buster. Wait a minute. No, oh. Owens. That's nasty. Kevin trying to fight as well. Oh. That's not that's not a good look guys. Bullfrog. Oh. That's another move. Again, where his weight adds to the effect. So he isn't jacked, right? He's, he's, hey, let, 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 let's be frank for a second. He's fat, okay? So <laughs> he isn't jacked, you know? He's, he's a little pudgy, but at the same time, that makes him look even scarier because he's, he's, you know, he's a threat. He's a big guy and he's a big, violent, scary dude. And I think that adds so, like so much, so much almost intrigue because it separates him from everybody else. Oh, oh. Great camera work as well. Oh, some of these moves are just so painful. Oh, dude, that looks like it hurts. I mean, he's a big guy and he's jumping with his full force onto you. There is no way that feels good. I really like that guy. He's a really interesting, sort of almost complex character. I mean, I, I, I really do like it. He's one of those people, I think, where if you see him the first time, you're like, is that guy, a, I mean, is that guy even an athlete? But he is. I mean, that's, that's what he is. He still manages to be an athlete, even with that little bit of punch. And I think that's just so impressive and so cool. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did and you're new here, make sure to subscribe. If you already subscribed, I don't know, turn on notifications or something. Uh, that helps with the channel. Helps you know when my videos come out. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.